Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, I'm Allie. So today I'm going to be unboxing my Boxy Lux for December for you guys, but I did want to explain my look real quick. It is looking slightly messy with my hooded eyes at this point, but I did film this look earlier this week. If you do want to go check it out, I will have it linked right up here for you guys. Okay, so... I have my big Boxy Lux. If you guys are not familiar with this, Boxy Charm is a $21 a month subscription box. You will get a regular Boxy Charm with five to six full size products every single month, but you can upgrade to the Boxy Lux, which your subscription will still stay at $21. You'll get the same five to six products every month besides the third month. The third month, you'll be charged the 21 plus $28.99. So it comes up to $50 for a bigger box like this that has 10 plus items in it. You get a big card like this that shows you all of your products and their retail value and all of that. So the theme this month is Tis the Sea Sun, which is really cute and has a flamingo. So the first thing in here is super exciting to me. If you guys have followed my blog, and my channel, you guys know that I'm a huge fan of Luxie brushes. We got this whole set right here this month, which is a eight piece set. It says complete face set, so that is awesome. It comes with a round top blender, a tapered highlighting, a pro precision, a tapered blending, eye shading, flat definer, brow and lash spoolie, and a lip brush. This is a cruelty-free brand, and this set right here retails for $65. This is their pink and, like, rose gold set, but I have been a huge fan of their brushes for so long now. They're really good quality, and I'm super excited to have even more of them. The next thing we have in here is from Tarte, and it is one of their Tartist Shimmering Lip Paints. I got the shade Strike Gold. It is a gold lip gloss, I'm assuming. Yes, it is definitely like a gloss. I've never tried Tarte's glosses. Sorry, I do have quite a few swatches already, but I have it over here. I really feel like clear glosses with gold shimmer in it has been a huge like trend this past year, but this does retail for $20. The next thing in here, and I'm really excited about this because I have never tried anything from Violet Voss, but we actually got one of their full size palettes. This is their pro hashtag my holy grail palette. So it has 20 highly pigmented eyeshadows and a variety of must-have finishes. Oh wow. Yeah, this is like a really thick palette. It looks like this. This palette retails for $45, which is really cool. It has like a little slip inside there, a huge mirror, and then you have these 20 shades right here, which are super pretty. I feel like this is a really good palette to get in December because I feel like you could come up with a lot of like festive warm tone looks with this. You have like a really pretty like orange, like almost mustard orange. It's really weird shade, but there's also the wine and dine down here, which is more like burgundy. You have some like metallics. Yeah, I'm really living for this palette. I am, of course, keeping this because for one, I'm swatching it, but for another reason is because I have never actually tried Violet Voss's formula, so I'm really excited to give that palette a go. Like I said, that does retail for $45. And this is what smells so good in the box. This is a spongel, or spongula. I'm not sure, it is a body wash infused buffer. So it does come in plastic and you can like push into it, but it still is like firmer and hard. But yeah, I'm really excited to try that out to like exfoliate and use as like a body wash. It smells so good. This retails for $20. I've never heard of this brand, but I'm excited to try that out. And this is probably the most expensive thing in this month's Boxy Lux. This is from Elmas. And this is their Pro Collagen Marine Cream. It is an anti-wrinkle day cream. This stuff is really bougie. This is what the bottle looks like. I was really hoping that we were going to get their like melt away 
makeup remover. It comes like in a bigger jar and it's like yellow, but I hear really good things about it. But at the same time, I'm really excited to try this out. This retails for $89, very pricey. It comes like with a little cap on the inside. That's literally all the product you get in there. That is insane to me. And I mean, it goes down further, but you still don't really get that much product. It has a slight scent, but not a, like a really strong scent. Let me get all the extra off. I'm not wasting that. It feels really nice on the skin though. It sinks right in. It does have like a slight perfume smell. It doesn't smell like horrible, but it's not like the best smell I've smelled either. It's kind of fresh. The next thing is from Wander Beauty. I've done a whole video on Wander Beauty before and I really like this brand. I did see this sneak peek and I'm kind of like, I don't know if this will work for me or not. This is the Wander Beauty Wanderous Dusk to Dawn palette. At first I thought it was another eyeshadow palette, but it's actually a cheek palette. It is a blush and highlighter palette. And it has a little mirror and then it has these three shades right there. So you have kind of like two blushes that I feel like I'll be able to get away with, but the highlighter, I don't know. I feel like it might be a little too dark for me. I might have to pass it along to somebody, but it might give the blushes a go. The highlight just looks pretty dark. This palette retails for $26. We also got a mascara this month from Lorac. This is their Pro Lash Pomade. I don't really wanna open it because I do have like some mascaras already opened, but I've never tried a mascara from Lorac, so I'm definitely down to try it out. This retails for $24. And so for this box, they actually gave you the option for the first time to pick between either an eyeshadow palette or a mini hair straightener. And I, of course, picked the straightener because although I love makeup and eyeshadow palettes and stuff, I did see the sneak peek that we were getting a Violet Voss palette. I didn't really like register like which one we were getting. I just knew we were already getting that. And then I seen that we were getting the Wander Beauty palette. And at the time, I wasn't... I didn't even know that it was like a face palette. So I did go with the straightener because I thought it was really cute, but it comes with a little case. This is from PYT and I got the bright yellow, which I think is super cute. And I feel like it's gonna be like really handy for like traveling and stuff like that, but it's supposed to get up to 400 degrees. And I mean, that's pretty good for such like a small straightener like this. I just think it's really cute and I'm really glad that I got it in a subscription box like this. That retails for $75, so that's awesome. And the very last thing they included in this box is a little wristlet bag that says Glam AF. And on the inside, you have a little portable charger. So you can charge this up and throw it in your purse. And whenever your phone needs a little bit of a charge, you can just plug it up. The end comes up and this goes into your phone to charge it, which I think is really handy and really nice to have. And I also like the little wristlet. This retails together for $22. And that brings the grand total of the December Boxy Lux to $386, which is crazy, especially when you're paying just $50 for this box and all of its products. So that is awesome. And I cannot wait to try out these products in upcoming videos, skincare videos on my Instagram, which I will throw up on the screen for you guys. And if you guys are liking my unboxings, make sure you guys are giving me some thumbs up. I have decided to go ahead and start through some of my unboxings and my insta stories on instagram because some of my smaller subscriptions are kind of just getting lost in the mix and it takes me a while to get some and then some get here really early so i think i'm just going to start doing a little bit of unboxings there on my insta stories if you guys want to follow me on instagram you'll catch those and then some of my bigger ones like fat fit fun boxy lux sometimes ipsy plus maybe i'll do all on my youtube but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.